Hey guys, welcome to this uh, base tutorial. I'm going to be uh, showing you guys how to play uh, Killing in the Name by Rage Against the Machine. Uh, the bass in the song is really awesome. It's really cool. Uh, their bass is, I think his name is Tim Comerford or something like that. He's a really, really good bass player. Reminds me of Flea for his, the style that he plays or whatever. And their guitar player, Tom Morello, is really awesome. I think they might be a band again when we broke up. Anyhow, so the song, I'm going to show you the, all the parts. I might play, I might forget this or that there. But for, for the most part, I'll just play it, you know. Drop D to it. just five. So yeah, that's pretty much the basic parts of the entire song. I didn't play it like verse, chorus, verse, like interlude, whatnot. So basically, it's just a power chord uh, on the 5th fret on the A string. What the hell it's... Three intro. Then it's... Six, six on the A. And even when the guitar kicks in and drums, he's still doing that. Which is the D, so it's 
three, five, back on the A, then open two, three, two, and then you know, and the same, go ahead, cross it, the same, that, that, he's doing it, but he's doing it a lot lighter, not as heavy as this. So there, it was open three, five, four on the D, on the G string. So it's three, five, four, open. So it's open D, open D. Three, five, four, three, five, three, three, five, two, one, two, three, two, three, five, four, three, five, two, three, 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 five, two, three, 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 back in the doodle Then it's like I said, so it's 3, 5, 4, 3, 5, 3, 3, 5, 2 And at one part when he's doing it He doesn't feel something like a uh, 10, 11, 12, 11, 12. Uh, no, wait, let's see. Uh, uh, so I still gotta count the frets even after all the sound. But 10, 11, 12, 10, 11, 12, 10, 11, 12, 10. So it's like. You'll hear it at some point, but you don't have to do it. Uh, so even when the solo is going on. The fret on the A string, and then when everything gets back in, we've done the solo. Five, five, open three, five, 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 open three, five. And then when it's like it's going up on the neck, just on the fifth, you can get creative. You know, you can just play like a pattern that's, you know. It's just nice. So yeah, that's pretty much it, the whole song. Uh, I know I didn't play it uh, exact song way, but the main parts are basically just that riff. Drop D tune. So yeah, uh, tell me off, whatever. I don't really care, it doesn't matter to me. <laughs> it's like, where's your version? Hey, I'll check out, uh, if you're a drummer, I'm a drummer, get my new kit soon. Uh, check out Lost Cables, drumsticks.com. Uh, for me, I've been drumming for over 20 years. Uh, these are my preferred choice of drumsticks, Canadian made, New Brunswick, same province I live in. Uh, I compare them with with the, the you know the major brands like Vic Firth, uh, Ahead, uh, Alloy, all those companies that make all kinds of you know really uh, you know big name sticks or whatever. But, you know, so uh, thanks for watching.